I've got two needles, and I have a Cook uh, transtracheal jet ventilation needle. I have another needle uh, that the company that creates it, I don't have, I don't remember exactly, but it, it actually will, you can actually tie it onto the patient. This, this, is a, this is a perfect size for like a pediatric patient. This is okay for a larger pediatric patient. The value is this, is it's a stiff, it won't bend. Most of these 14 gauge catheters that we use for transtracheal jet ventilation, they kink. The bend train device, the bend train device is a, is a device that is, I think, perfect for uh, transtracheal jet ventilation. It has the option to actually ventilate the patient because as you, as you inject air for two seconds at 15 liters per minute, you'll put in, for two seconds, you put in 500 ml. You can lift your thumb, thumb sucking, think about thumb suckers, you know, little kids. Thumb sucking pulls the air out. And so you totally, so if you have complete airway obstruction, this actually lets you remove the air from the chest rather than just put air in and then pray to God that it goes somewhere, you know, to have complete up airway obstruction. It also has the option for passive, passive expiration. So you let your finger up, keep your thumb on that, on the, on the top port. There's two ports. The, the top port for sucking it out. The bottom port is for passive expiration. I also then have oxygen and we'll crank it up to like 15 liters and we'll see if we can ventilate, okay? Uh, I'm going to find the triclosyroid membrane, so I think here's my larynx, and I have to assume it's right about, it's right about here. Is that right? Yes. Okay. All right. So I'm going to go, I'm going to go in with this, I'm going to aspirate, okay, got air, okay, so um, pull my needle out. Now let's watch this. So we will hook this up. Okay, if you'll stabilize that, if you stabilize that, now two seconds. I'm sucking the air out. Two seconds in, 500 ml. That's at 15 liters per minute. Okay, I'm gonna do passive exploration. Let's see if the chest wall is rising at all. No way. Now, for pediatric patients, one liter per year of age, starting at two. So if you have a um, three-year-old kid, then it would be three liters per minute. And that would be 50 ml per second and 100 ml per two seconds. Okay? Yep. Alright. So that's it. So that's the, the venturing device and it, it allows both um, passive and active suctioning of the air out. Obviously no chest wall movement here, no chest wall movement, but um, it is a, 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 an excellent tool for uh, transpracheal jet ventilation.